Oh, that's a good question, Butch. Do you guys have superstitions? I'm not superstitious, but I'm a little stitious. <laughs> that was the I was dumbest just joke say that. that one uh, screw you. <laughs> Turn it off. I personally get up the puck. Don't yes. believe in it. I'm Broken not surprised mirror. that you say that. Yeah, there's a you like, have that I don't care attitude. It, I'm religious, so it's like I just don't believe in that like the broken mirror, the spilled salt, the under the ladder, the black cat. Like I don't believe in that stuff, but I'm trying to think of Dude, I'm s- also I don't believe in like I believe in setting goals, but I don't believe in like manifesting. Really? If that makes sense. Mm. How? how? How do you not believe so, in that? Because it's like I manifested this, I did this. No, I believe in setting goals. Yeah, you but, that, but you don't think you, that helped you get and, it? And then you but that's the thing. My definition of manifesting isn't the true definition of manifesting. Well, it, I think it's just like I guess if you really just break manifesting down, it's like that's what you think about. The things that you think about you attract. Right. So I still believe in that. Mm-hmm. Law of attraction and, yeah, and it's setting all about goals what you think. and but anyway, no, I'm not superstitious. At I'm all, always at very all. careful about what I have like come out of my mouth because I don't know why, but that's it, funny because you say a lot of stupid. <laughs> shit. I know, I know, but I mean, like, not I say stupid shit, but obviously, like, careful about what I say is going to happen or mm-hmm. like I don't know because oh, okay. shit. Yeah, yeah. It seems I don't know. Maybe I'm just paranoid, but it seems like it ends up happening. Oh, I feel that. So you gotta so, be careful what you say. So you are a little stitious. But I'm, I'm very superstitious, and also I'm the total opposite of you. I think manifesting is like huge. But yeah, no, I think I think it is dude, too. I when just, I was in like hockey, I used to like always like, dude, it was so weird. Like I had to put like my pads on a certain way. That's OCD because I was worried maybe something bad might happen in the game or something. I don't know. It was just I guess weird. That is and like yeah. I even damn near didn't take lunchbox the cat because he was a black cat. I was like, this just seems a little weird. He's the truth black comes cats out hanging out around us, and so you are very super. I'm very super superstitious. I would I wouldn't walk <laughs> under a ladder. I don't do okay. anything. Really? Yeah. Oh, my no, gosh. Fuck no. All right, we got two complete wow. opposites yeah. here. Yeah. But, uh, how, I mean, look at Mike. He's very low strong, and I'm pretty high strong. I mean, what do you strong. expect? Yeah. But also with the manifesting thing, I think it's like, I mean, if you believe in it and you set your goals and you stick to it, I think it all yeah, but I don't, huge. Yeah, but I don't disagree with that at all. I think. I thought you said that. No, I oh. just don't believe in, like, it, manifesting is like being your own god, I guess. Mm. I just I like setting goals, but you know, it's just a higher power for me. I sometimes I get really turned off when you get like chicks that are like, I manifested that. I I said I would get this job and I manifested I talked about that and I well, got they the got job. Got it, dude. Good for them. I know. <clears throat> but probably did. I'm just saying they like abuse the actual word, <clears throat> but Yeah, I mean, I'm very quietly, like I quietly manifest. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I think it's all just what you put out into the universe kind of comes back around. Mm-hmm. Karma. That too. I don't really believe in karma either. Really? As you could probably I guess, do. but yeah. good, bad karma, good karma. Yeah. I feel like none of it. Really? Do you guys think bad hap- thing bad things happen in threes? No. I think that. Why? Yeah. Why? I don't know. It just seems like a couple bad things happen, then it's all good. In yeah, it seems. Yeah, I guess I could see that. It's like when things go wrong, a bunch of shit goes wrong. I think that there's like a why three though. I just I, I do don't love know. saying I think that's uh, just like the term. But I, do I love think saying it's third time's a charm. Third time's a charm. <laughs> you know, when you like fuck up two times and you're like, oh, third time's a charm. <laughs> yeah. I, there is something that like you know, you see somebody you're just like, damn, bad shit's always just happening to them. And it's normally a lack of preparation. Uh I met a dude, broke his leg, got fired from his job, and then something else happened. But he got fired from his job because he broke his leg, and then because he broke his leg, he like couldn't afford his house payment or something like that and he was putting this up on snapchat and so it's kind of like sometimes cause and effect of things that happen like one bad thing happens and then kind of other bad things can come of it well there's a reaction every action yeah it's exactly it's a reaction and so that's why i sometimes think you can get stuck in like bad ruts right it's stuck in a good flow and it's all about momentum exactly and also i really applaud people that can realize that's happening to them and then understand that the losing the the job was because of that it's still mm-hmm. horrible but like when they can understand that versus just going bad stuff's always happening to me you yeah. know some people are just unlucky, unlucky. Though. That's, that's true some people are also very lucky but then again i don't know how true that is because a lot hang of around the right people and you put yourself in the right space good in the right situations you yeah, hang around yeah, the wrong people up. yeah bad shit's gonna happen i mean that's why, like, so I wouldn't go as far as to say I don't believe in luck because uh, that's pretty aggressive. However, it's like, really, what is luck? Is it what? just life? Like, when, when something good happens to you, you go, awesome. 
I'm happy that happened to me. It was kind of random, but I, I'm happy. Better be lucky like, than good. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. That, dude. <laughs> um, so just like, so you don't believe in manifestation. You don't believe in luck. You don't believe in karma. You don't believe in any of that. Is that all because you're you're very religious? Yeah, really. So Is, like, they teach you that. Yeah, I think they don't really? like, teach you like these are bad things, but it's like really like. Be real. What is luck? What is luck? I mean, luck could mean you're lucky, or you could be like, "Oh, God, bless me with this." Right. But it's kind of they're they're just a different. Or term maybe it's for, neither. It's just maybe it's just a good thing happened to you. I'm saying like you don't really have to put up. <clears throat> How much do you <clears throat> tribute your successes to God? Um, I guess like like That's any person, you know, like you just like are happy at the end of the day and you thank Him. But don't other than think? that, I attribute most of our success and my success to hard work and you guys pushing me and us pushing each other. And so do you pray every night then? Like you, you ask no, for things you don't, no. oh, I was going to say that'd be literally manifestation then. Right. You'd be manifesting. That. Well, do you ever, but, if but you're asking, like, but, please help so that way I do good on whatever I'm doing. That's true. the exact same thing. Same thing, I guess. Yeah. It's mm-hmm. either telling yourself or telling God, but you put it out into the universe or God or whatever you yeah. think. I don't not believe in manifestation. I just like the, the true definition of manifestation, I don't. But the, all the things that come with it, I believe in that. Why are you so superstitious? Like, why wouldn't you walk under a ladder? Uh, where did the, where did that stem from? I don't know. So like, I'm what is like, it? What's gonna happen? I'm just Tell a me, paranoid what's gonna dude. Happen? I don't know. If I just don't want to risk it. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. I am just Fair a enough. paranoid dude. I don't know. I just because it's like risk what. Risk what? Well, I don't want to like risk some... having some bad shit happen. And then I'm going to be like, God damn it. And then you blame I... it on the ladder. I don't like, know if I do that. Mean, that's what, what I mean. If you might go like, you walk under a ladder and then you stub your toe. You go, God damn, I knew okay. I shouldn't have walked under that. I stub my toe. I'm, I'm not using a put. super like, easy yeah, example. Yeah, yeah. You, stubbing your toe is. You walk under a ladder, you're driving home and you hit a deer runs into you and you go, oh, I knew it was that ladder. Or maybe the deer just ran into you. You know, bad right. things could happen because of a reaction or good things could happen. But then you start uh, thinking about it. Then you're like, that's oh. true. You're then looking, you're just for, the looking bad thing. for it. Then you're it looking is for interesting, it. Though, I like, don't know. I just think there's a negative to every positive, and uh, you have to like. It sounds really weird, but I like the way I navigate is very like I don't know. I just always have it in the back of my head. I think that I if, do things, like, like, if you truly important. believe there's a negative so to every positive, then then I, a lot of that makes sense. You know, like yeah. if the, if there's a negative to every positive, then. You do have to navigate. You got to like kind of pick and choose. I don't know. It's weird. Yeah. 